All right, update on Jasmine. So you, your your local bottom was eight two one. Um, now is that the confirmed local bottom for a higher low? It's hard to know yet. I think in a day or two we'll know if that was the local bottom. But if it is, that's a higher low, which is bullish, and that would mean we're in an uptrend now on the smaller time frames. If you want to be bullish on the daily time frame, you still need to get way up here to above nineteen point eight twenty cents to be safe. Um, if you're close the daily candle twenty cents higher and higher, I will say that um, you're probably gonna make a new all-time high on Jasmine if that were to happen. Until then, um. I would say for right now, if you close the daily candle above, uh, what I say, if you close the daily candle above uh, nine cents, then I would say this is a higher low and that we're going higher and that we have a short term uptrend in play um, on the smaller time frames. And the next target, if this was the local bottom and this was a higher low, would be the 236 fit, which you got rejected off of the other day up here at 11.7, 11.8. If you get above that, you'll be looking at the 0.382 fit up here at 14.7. And like I said, your ultimate target on the daily time frame to be bullish would be 20 cents. Uh, but overall, I would say Jasmine is probably still an uptrend. I would, I think this is actually the local bottom here. Down here at six two or whatever the six one whatever the low was, and also the MACD is going up. No, I do think that was definitely the bottom there, and we are go headed up on Jasmine. Um, and those are the targets to the upside. Um, I do think if you get above twenty cents again, uh, Jasmine is probably going to make a new all time high in January. If it you know depending on what Bitcoin does, Bitcoin's now above fifty thousand dollars. It went up to what fifty one four, and I believe that's exactly where the two three six is for. So for Bitcoin, that's also getting rejected. Well, I should say getting rejected. It's consolidating from there. Um, so if Bitcoin gets above the two three six fib on its uh, on Bitcoin, then I would say this is going to uh, go uh, probably to the three eight two fib, if not even to the point five fib on Jasmine. Um, because when Bitcoin starts going up, I think Jasmine will go up even faster than Bitcoin, which means eventually the 618 will probably get hit if Bitcoin go, go, gets above its 618. Um, so I would say Jasmine probably in January doesn't make a new all-time high. I think for December, it's it's bearish. Uh, well, I think it was bearish for December. I think the bottom is in. Um, but I do think January is probably January, February is probably going to be a new all-time high on Jasmine if that's the case. And if you, if you get above the 618, then I think all-time high is imminent. And Jasmine would probably be targeting 50 cents after 35 cents was the all-time high. So I target 35 cents for an all-time high and then 50 cents. Uh, but I think that's a month or two away. But I do think Jasmine makes an all-time high probably in a month or two. Um, that's all I got. See you guys in the next one. I think Jasmine short term is bullish, assuming you don't lose this local low, this new higher low of 8.3. If you go below 8.3, then we can't really say we're an uptrend. We're probably then then the downtrend actually might not be over. But as long as you stay above, I would say 8 cents, I think we're good on Jasmine short term. That's all I got. See you guys in the next one.